Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you that how you can add a video on your home page of the Shopify store. I have installed down theme and currently on my screen you can see that I have already implemented that feature which is like video is auto playing and it is also repeating over and over again that is called as loop and uh, I will show you step by step you should continue watching this complete video so that you don't miss the single step and uh, you don't need to know all about the coding you just follow the steps which I will be showing you in this video so currently I have removed the code so let me refresh this page if I am refreshing it then you will no more able to see that video displaying down below why because I have removed the code so let me show you how you should do by your own here is the dashboard of the Shopify store so you can see that I have installed the down theme and let's click on customize so once you are clicking on customize then you have to click on add section here we have uh, one option of custom liquid click on that and here we are going to write the code so first of all we need to write here video and then we have some attributes to write here this is actually the video tag open and video tag close alright and inside of this video uh, opening tag we need to write controls we need to write autoplay then loop then plays inline and uh, finally we have muted so these are the uh, five attributes which you must write here then after we need to write source source is also one of the tag inside of it we are going to write src attribute and inside of it inside the double quotes we will be writing the url of our uh, video so how we will be going to upload it is that first of all you need to go to your dashboard of the Shopify once again then you need to click on settings and here we have files click on upload file and I have this video which I am going to upload over here so you have to wait for a while until this is uploading successfully once that is uploaded then you need to copy the URL and paste it into that specific uh, SRC attribute Finally the video is uploaded this is the video and now you need to copy this link click on this icon and the video link is copied and that video link I need to paste in between these double quotes so I have to right click and then paste it here so this video is actually now displaying displaying here let me save these changes and let me show you how it will be reflecting on the front end let me refresh this page and now you will see that this video is too big here you can see that the size of this video is very large so how we can reduce the sizes uh, first of all we need to write some CSS code on the top which is like style attribute and inside of it we have close uh, tag of the style and then we have to write video inside of it we are writing here display block then we have uh, display block and uh, margin zero auto in that way the, uh, the that specific video would be in the center then we have width width should be 50 percent so that will be suitable otherwise it the video size would be too large so here we go actually we have already added all the things like controls autoplay sorry autoplay uh, spelling mistake which is a u t o p l a y then loop then all the things so now you can save these changes and here you can see that this is already auto playing so once the changes are saved then you should refresh it again and here we go now you can see that this video should auto play here and uh, here you can also see that these controls are also showing control means play button and the, uh, this timing and uh, unmuted option and all so if you are interested to remove controls then you will no more able to see those uh, controls I mean the play button and all here you can see that if you are hovering over it then you will no more able to uh, see those uh, play buttons one important thing that I wanted to show here is that uh, uh, if you are auto playing this video then you will you must have to mute it I mean you must have to write the uh, attribute which is muted muted means you will not able to listen the sound 
at the initial point of time but you need to unmute this video and then after you will able to listen the uh, sound of this video because this is quite disturbing so now all the browsers has uh, banned this feature because they want that if you are interested to autoplay the video then you are no more able to unmute this it at the initial time you have to manually unmute this uh, video and if you are not auto playing then you can keep it unmuted all right so this is the important thing that you have to keep in mind so one last thing that we need to add here is that for the mobile responsive how it will look like for example i am uh, clicking on inspect and here you can see that this would be the mobile view i mean on the mobile screen it would look little smaller so how we can uh, actually fix this issue is like we can we can add some media query so uh, here you can see that we have the style tag inside of this style we have actually written some css and here we need to write some media query which is like media media screen and inside of it we have to write max width which should be 800 i mean uh, 8 below 800 pixel all the screens we are going to add a CSS of video inside of it we are going to write width 100% or maybe 90% because in that way what we are actually writing here is like uh, for all the screens it would be 50% screen size of the video but on the other screens for example in the mobile view the video width would be larger why because it is looking smaller let's refresh this page again and see how it looks so now this is looking pretty fine if you wanted to increase its size or decrease its size you can actually write here uh, the percentage value for example 90 to 100 percent 95 percent or maybe 80 percent so according to your own choice you can actually increase or decrease the uh, size all right so finally we finished the mobile view as well so if you are still facing any issue, you are thinking that this is a little tough for you, you can contact me. I will be adding contact details below in the description. So if you are thinking this video was useful for you, please like this video. Also subscribe this channel. Thank you so much once again. See you in the next video.